Okay, we are at Fish Restaurant. It's on Jones Street and Bleecker Street. We got the Bleecker Burger. It's Ottomanelli's famous blended burger. So actually right across the street here is Ottomanelli's butcher shop. Very, very famous butcher shop. So we got their blend working on the burger. And actually I will say, Ottomanelli's is right there. We're actually next to John's at Bleecker too. Fantastic pizza, friend of the program. Probably like, Best pizza I've ever had. I'm with Dave on it. It's fantastic. This looks messy. We got actually like authentic looking bacon, like straight up real bacon. I'm actually just gonna take this bite of bacon and then just spread the other ones around because it looks so good. This looks almost Luger's esque, how fatty and nice it is. We got nicely thin cut pickles, thin cut onions, some sort of white sauce. It looks a little too thin to be mayo. It almost looks like white sauce from like a halal truck, from halal guys. I just don't know how I'm gonna put these two together. This is gonna take a lot of precision, a lot of skill in my day of doing this. Wow. That was what I thought. That that was. I feel like Spider Man. I feel like a superhero. This is gonna be high. I'm gonna go with a 4.5 on the bleeding burger at Tuna Restaurant. I'm impressed. They're getting an authentic smile. Not everybody gets an authentic smile. Now, as I said, this is a fish restaurant, so of course it's very seafoody. We got a full lobster out there. It looks like a nice seafood feel. So I went with the uh, Narragansett Fresh Catch, the beer they had. It's a refreshing blonde ale, dry hopped, clean finish. Actually a fantastic looking beer. They gave the cans they didn't give. That just looks fantastic. We've got the nice lobster there, blue, red, white, and blue. Just a beautiful design. So I'm sure this is gonna be a tasty beer. The last time I fished was like when my dad forced me to like one time in Montauk when I was about four. I haven't fished since then, but I, if I ever fished again, I could actually see myself drinking that. I'm just gonna trust Narragansett and say it's a good fishing beer. I'm gonna say 3.8 balls on the Narragansett Fresh Catch. Now to the fries. These do look a little show so I thought a place with such a good looking burger, like such a dedicated, fantastic looking burger, the fries would look a little better. This is straight up, this is, this is seafood. I mean, having a legit Old Bay seasoning on the table, Beautiful, let's get one more bite with the Old Bay. Old Bay seasoning is so fucking good, it's heavenly. I'm gonna say the fries are like a, a 2.8 balls, but with the Old Bay seasoning, that screws it up to about a 3.4. Now, finally the ambiance here. Very authentic seafood. I like when a seafood place sells shirts and they have shirts on the wall. I think that's always a cool touch for a seafood place. I don't know why, I just really enjoy that. That's a great touch, couple lobsters in front. Things written on the wall, like it's the glass that you just write on. I don't know why, but those are all like perfect things I find for a seafood place. I don't know, don't know why at all, but that's just the shit I love. So I do like the vibe here. I would love to come back here for dinner or lunch, like ready for an authentic seafood dinner, like bib on, ready to crack some lobster, because that's what this joint seems like. I'm gonna go a little high on the ambiance. I love the feel here. I'm gonna go 4.6 balls on the ambiance at Fish Restaurant. I got like a Tina Turner girl singing right now, it's terrible. But 4.6, great place. I love the street, Weaker Street. I never realized there's just every food on the planet.